Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to get started with Fonse Realistic Digital Planner. To download the planner, log into your Etsy account and navigate to the account settings. Then select Purchases and Reviews. Locate the relevant order and click on the Download Files. Here you'll find all the files associated with your purchase. Let's download the 2023 Digital Planners. To open the planner, navigate to the Downloads section of the Files app. First, you'll need to unzip the archive. Tap and hold on the file and select Uncompress. Open the newly created folder and tap and hold on the desired version of the planner. From the pop-up menu, select Share and then Open in Good Notes to open the planner in the app. Good Notes app defaults to Write mode. To use hyperlinks, switch to Read only mode by tapping the crossed out pencil icon. Tap pencil with the curve icon to switch back to Write mode. Let's take a look at the index page. The index page serves as a table of contents for your planner. It's clickable, allowing you to quickly navigate to different parts of the planner. Tap the binder rings to go back to the index page. By clicking on top tabs, you can easily access all the different sections of your planner, including wellness, key dates, checklists, and notes. Our digital planner is designed with the user in mind and features side tabs that look like real paper tabs, allowing you to quickly switch between your monthly planners and access weekly and daily templates. Tap the date in the corner to go to the daily page. Click V to go to the vertical weekly layout page. And click H to go to the horizontal one. Each template has extra buttons to go to the additional pages. Quick access to the information without having to flip through multiple pages makes navigation much faster. The planner allows you to easily switch back and forth between two weekly layouts, a horizontal layout and a vertical layout. The vertical layout is perfect for time box planning, while the horizontal one offers more space for creativity. It includes an additional calendar for an overview of the week. Both layouts have buttons to access the weekly overview and weekly reflection pages. Click the date to go directly to the daily page. If you are looking for some note paper templates, the notes section has got you covered. Here you'll find all the popular ones like dots, lines, Cornell style pages and many more. Now let's talk about the calendar page. We've made it super easy for you to navigate through the planner by making all dates and weeks clickable. We've even organized the links into vertical and horizontal weekly pages for your convenience. And guess what? We've added five custom sections. Want to add your own templates? No problem. Just head to the notes section, find the template you want, copy it, Go back to your custom section and paste the page right after the divider. And here it is. You can even duplicate it as many times as you need. How cool is that, right?
Here you can also delete unused templates. And now let me show you some of our additional planner sections. We've included a wellness section with a variety of templates, including habit tracker, to help you take care of yourself. By building good habits each month, you can increase your self-discipline and make progress towards your goals. In the nutrition section, you can organize your favorite recipes and meal plans. In the life goals section, you can set short, mid and long-term goals and track your progress. It's a great way to stay motivated and focused on your objectives. The key dates section will help you track important events and deadlines. And of course, all dates are clickable. If you're working on a project, our project planner section is the ultimate tool to help you stay organized and productive. This section includes everything you need to plan and execute your projects efficiently, from timelines to Kanban board and more. Now let me show you how to import and use our digital stickers. First, download the GoodNote sticker book file. And I'm also going to download the archive with the covers. Next, open the Files app, navigate to the download section, where you'll find the sticky book file with the GoodNotes extension. Tap and hold over the file, select Share, and then open in GoodNotes. Import it as a new document, choose the destination directory, and import the sticky book file. You can easily navigate to your preferred sticker colors by clicking the rectangles on the tab menu, including the project stickers. To add a sticker to your planner, turn off read-only mode, select the lasso tool, long press the sticker you want to use and tap copy. Then go to any page of your planner, tap and hold to paste the sticker, then resize and rotate it as needed. To remove the sticker, just delete it the same way. Now let's try to change the cover image of your planner. First, go to the Files app and unzip the archive with covers. Then navigate to the cover page in your planner and tap on the Add page icon. Choose Import and select the cover you want from the directory with covers. Once it's open, you can remove the old cover by going to the Thumbnails menu and selecting Move to Trash under the cover page thumbnail. Now you have a brand new cover for your planner. One of the great benefits of the realistic planner is that it can be used in a vertical orientation which provides more working space and larger layout elements. I really hope this user guide video has been helpful in getting started with your digital planner. And I hope you enjoy using the realistic planner as much as we enjoyed creating it for you. Happy planning!